Hey what's up guys, I am here and today we have the WK Ultra Smartwatch which is one of the latest Apple Watch Ultra replicas. It is sent by the longer official store on AliExpress and in this video we are going to check every feature in this smartwatch. Before we start, make sure to hit the subscribe button. So let's open it. So first of all we have another box in which we have the wireless charger, the user manual and I've gotten two straps inside it, the ocean strap and the nylon strap and after that we have the WK Ultra smartwatch. So let's take off the plastic wrap and here is the first look on the smartwatch. Let's turn it on and here is the first look on the display. So if you talk about the smartwatch it comes with 2.05 inches of display as advertised and it has 520 into 580 resolution and the resolution actually looks quite high the display is really smooth and the colors are really good and here is the bezel size after that we have the crown key which can be used to access the menu and to go back and to change the watch faces you can also use it in the menu to animate icons and to scroll in a list then we have the side button and one thing that I really didn't like about it is that the side button and the click function on the crown key have the same functionality then we have the microphone and the additional holes on the right side and both of the holes are open and on the left side we have the action key which can be used to access any specified application you can go into settings and here you can find the side key settings and you can use the functionality according to your preference for example if you select music when we will click the action key it will open the music controller then we have the speaker and the additional holes here the upper additional hole seems to be closed and two to three speaker holes are also closed and on the back side we have the wireless charging and health sensors and we we also have the real screws at the back and then we have the strap locks and the strap locks are real and the straps won't move from their original place no matter how hard you try. So to remove the straps you can just press the button and then just push the straps and they will come out that easily. So the seller also sent out two extra ocean straps so I can show you how all of them look on the smartwatch. So let's try all of them. So here is the orange ocean strap which comes inside the box and here is how it looks. And then we have the black ocean strap which just looks so good with the smartwatch. And then here is the ocean strap in white color and in the end we have the black Black nylon strap so which one is your favorite let me know about it in the comment section below as there is no mention of the smartwatch being waterproof so i will assume that the smartwatch is not waterproof although it can be used normally while washing hands or in rainy days but it shouldn't be used while taking baths or swimming let's check out the watch faces the watch faces are also themed and when you tap on them, it can change colors. The watch faces are also interactive and you can access the applications which are shown on the watch face. And we also have this game watch face, so you will have to tap this icon to start it and then you will have to run in the lines which have the football and avoid the lines which have the bomb. So there are three lifelines which means if you will hit the bomb thrice, you will die. The smartwatch has its own themes and the icons are not similar to watch OS. And in this honeycomb menu style, if you use the crown key to scroll all the way down, it will animate the icons. And and if you scroll all the way up it will open the application which is in the middle and there are four menu styles in the smartwatch and the theme is not bad it is really good the colors are really vibrant and the smartwatch is just too smooth just look at this and on the home screen we have the control center with a lot of options then we have the quick access menu we have quick access applications and then we have the notifications the smartwatch also has a screen of tile which can be turned on or off from the control center and you can customize the side key to turn on the screen of tile. dial so when i'll press it it will turn on the screen of dial with the analog clock on it. You can customize its time from the settings and in bright screen duration. It can be a maximum of 10 minutes. And the normal screen on time on the watch face can be a maximum of 30 seconds. And it can also be changed from settings and in screen of time. It can be a minimum of 3 seconds and a maximum of 30 seconds. Let me show you all of the languages supported by the smartwatch. It uses the Wearfit Pro application and the smartwatch is detected as WK8 Ultra. It also comes with many watch faces in the dial market. While one thing that I didn't like about this application is that some of the watch faces are paid. Although most of the Series 8 watch faces are available for free, but I still think that the watch faces shouldn't be paid and all of them should be free. You can also use your own picture from the gallery and you can customize the style and color of the clock and also the position of the clock. It cannot use analog clock on it and these are the only three positions where you can place the digital clock on the watch face. You can also install some additional applications. Temperature, meteorological data and short video controller are installed by default while you can install the breathe rate, blood sugar and you and me application from the application market in the watch application. In notification, you can receive notifications for calls directly on the smartwatch without having to turn on bluetooth calling while other than that it can only send you notification of the applications which are mentioned here. Then we have wallet, business card, health reminders. You can also push weather updates. Then here is NFC guide. 
You can also use your smartphone as a Bluetooth shutter button and click pictures by simply tapping on the smartphone. Then we have the find bracelet option. It won't ring, it will only vibrate, which literally kills the benefit of this feature. You can also add your favorite contacts in the smartwatch, there is no limit mentioned here. In the end, we have other settings of early point measurement, race to wake, and 12 hour clock. To connect with Bluetooth calling, access the control center and enable this icon. And connect with watch call in your Bluetooth settings. Once it's connected, you can use your smartwatch to call directly from here. You can also set the volume from here. And you can also talk directly using the microphone and the speaker. And you can also receive calls directly on it. And it does show the name of the caller without having to sync the contacts, which is a great feature. And once Bluetooth calling is connected, you can also use voice assistant. Hey Siri, how's the weather today? And once Bluetooth calling is connected, you can use a smartwatch to play any sound playing on your smartphone. If you check out the health related applications with the heart rate checker, sleep tracker, blood pressure checker, blood oxygen level checker, and in app store we have the body temperature checker. And as I mentioned earlier, you can download the breathe rate and blood sugar trends application from the watch application. If you use the pulse rate checker in the air, it does calculate the data which means that it doesn't have proximity sensor and it makes me wonder if the sensors are real or not. So you can subscribe to my shorts channel where I test these smartwatches with real oximeter to see if the sensors are real or not. I'm gonna be linking the channel in the description box below. There are also many sports related applications. We have the fitness class. You can join it in the WearFit Pro application. And we have a lot of sport modes given here. There are indoor sports and then we have the outdoor sports. And whichever mode you will choose, it will calculate the steps you have walked, the total calories burned, your pulse rate, your steps per minute. And I think here it will show your speed of how much kilometers per hour you are walking. And here it will show the total total distance you have covered. Then we have the data which shows all of your fitness data. We have altitude barometer which shows the barometer data and altimeter shows the altitude data. Then we have stopwatch and timer to help you out in your workouts. And other than that, we have WeChat and Facebook applications to show you the notifications from WeChat and Facebook. Then we have alarm clocks. You can add alarms directly in the smartwatch. We also have two games, colorblind card and goalkeeper. This game is also available on the watch face. We have the music controller by which you can control the media playing on your device. We have the play post the next track previous track or increase or decrease volume options given here then we have the calculator so if you need to calculate anything you can do it directly on the wrist and the weather application shows the weather for the current day the weather right now the high and lows of the current day and also the weather for the next four days in the settings we have the raise your hand to brighten up the screen option so whenever you raise your hand the screen will brighten up then we have the bedside clock mode so whenever you put your device on the charger it will turn on and always on display with clock on it i've already shown you the screen of dial and the screen of time and the languages you can also set the time directly from here and you can also choose to sync it with the watch application and yeah, the brightness adjustment if you talk about the full brightness then just like the other wayfit pro smartwatches the full brightness level is really high and the smartwatch will be clearly visible in the daylight with a clear and crisp display you can mute the incoming calls or the vibration on the incoming call and you can also mute the dial while dialing calls and the vibration when dialing calls you cannot set separate ring tunes you can only turn the vibration on or off and customize the sound level for music and calls we have do not disturb mode which can also be scheduled then we have a lot of health reminders here we also have the power saving mode so this smartwatch comes with a very small battery it has a 200 mAh of battery inside it which can give you three days on normal usage five days on standby and around six days on power saving mode you can also add password to add an extra layer of security you can connect to the watch application using this qr code and about shows the name as wk ultra and the firmware i'm running is version 1.01 .01. and now let's test the smoothness and just like the other WearFit Pro smartwatches. This is also the smoothest Apple Watch Ultra replica I've seen and used so far alongside the HW8 Ultra and HW8 Ultra Max. And the scrolling is also just too smooth on these smartwatches. So guys, this is all from today's video and this is surely one of the best and smoothest Apple Watch Ultra replicas I've used and seen so far. The only things that I would like to see in the WearFit Pro smartwatches are the icons similar to WatchOS, a bigger battery, always on display option and a better watch application. And the watch application should be improved with the option to send notification for all application and all of the watch faces should be free if you would like to purchase it i'm gonna be leaving the purchase link in the description box below and i would really appreciate if you can use that link to purchase the smartwatch you can also check out my best apple watch series 6 7 8 and ultra replicas playlist i'm gonna be linking it in the description box below also make sure to hit the subscribe button to see more videos like this i will catch you in the next one until next time this is imat peace